Yo, what is Gucci and the Gucci Urban family and what is good YouTube? Now, I know I haven't been uploading lately and that's because I've been in college, man. College has been mad stressful. All my classes have been like taking away most of my time. So I'm sorry for not uploading lately, but I will be uploading a lot more soon. The holidays are coming up, so you guys already know I'm going to bring a lot of great content. But without further ado, you guys already know that we're going to be talking about the Yeezy Beluga 2.0 that just dropped last Saturday. I believe it was last Saturday. So I'm going to be showing you a comparison between the first Yeezy V2 and this one right now. So yeah, you already know, man. Let's get it. I know you a letter, send my kite back, send my one back, ASAP, ASAP. You know you keep a nigga grinded, man. You keep my head out like that. Here we have the box to the Yeezy Beluga 2.0 that just released this Saturday. Well, last Saturday was when this video will be showing. You guys can check. Size 11. Same color color code. Uh, and I already took the shoes out of the box because I'm showing you guys both pairs of the first release and then the second release. This here is the second release. Just give you guys an overall look before I go into detail as to how these are a lot more different. Uh, for one, these are a lot more different because of the release amount that they uh, let go all over the world. Approximately, I think it was like 90K, well, 90,000 of these were made. So these are the least, uh, as you, uh, you could say, rare. Like, there's not too much hype on these. The resale isn't too crazy on these because of the fact that so many were made. But obviously, if you wait a while, stock always goes up on Yeezys. But yeah, these, basically, if you tried to get these, you could have gotten your hands on them. And you guys probably seen on social media, so many people were trying to resell them and stuff like that because so many people got their hands on these. So yeah, same boost bottom. Same pattern. The only difference I would show you is that the laces, here you can see the laces right here. The laces on this pair is a lot more different than the first pair. Supply 350 doesn't have the original, uh, the first pair actually had that orange stripe. These just have the Supply 350 in orange. Uh, this one has a pull tab, and as you guys are gonna see in the first one, they didn't have the pull tab. But same bottom, same rubber sole, same insole, I believe. I don't remember, because I took the insole out of my first pair. So, yeah, this is basically the Yeezy V2 2.0 Beluga that just released last Saturday. Here we have the first pair. As you guys can see, it's still kind of the same pattern, but as I bring it around, you guys can see the major difference in that red-orange stripe. Well, I'm pretty sure it's a lot more orange. Uh, the Splite 350 isn't written in orange, it's written in gray because of the stripe being orange. And my favorite part, the laces, the design on them is a lot more different than the second pair. I actually prefer this, the first pair, and again, like I said, there's no pull tab on this one. I actually prefer the first pair, one, because it was a lot more limited, so it make, it's a lot more special. You don't see this as much as on people's feet, as you are going to see on, with the second pair. Uh, and so, I, as I said, I took, the, I took out the insole because these are 10 and a half. I usually wear an 11. But yeah, same bottom. These are a lot more dirtier because I actually wear my Yeezys. I wear all my shoes. So yeah, that's the pretty much biggest, uh, biggest difference between both. Uh, another big difference is... The gray, it's a lot darker on the V, uh, the 2.0 version. I actually prefer the gray on these, but I prefer the laces on these. And yeah, this is basically the difference between both. Uh, yeah. But as you guys can see on the back, no pull tab. The supply is different on both. The gray and the laces inside is pretty much the same. Yeah. So yeah, that's basically the difference between both shoes. Uh, I'm gonna be showing you guys an on foot, and I hope you guys uh, enjoy that. Let's get it. I'm really trying to get up out my mama crib like son. Pull her in the big crib, the glass house or son. Somewhere probably in the hills, but she ain't gotta worry. She know her son up in these streets. I'm back and forth and pacing, thinking about another race. I ain't even fucking racist. Only thing that's young and never like was green faces. My dad was in the past and I ain't seen him since the ages. Probably 14, 15, especially when the young nigga had dreams and I was really balling with the spot. Now I'm balling in these stores, I'm really shopping in this often. I can tell you about some prices that's gonna put you in the coffin. I done fucked a lot of bitches in the city to the socket. Adidas sweatpants in my easy zone. Yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the on foot of the V2 2.0, man. This is a very clean model. I actually like, I prefer these on foot, but I actually prefer the other Yeezys, like the first pair. I really like those, but these on foot do look nice. That gray, I'm telling you, is, is, is what gets me. I might just swap the laces from the first pair onto the second pair, 
because I do like the laces on the first pair. So yeah, man. If you aren't already subscribed to my uh, YouTube channel, please do that. I will be bringing a lot better, more like a lot, but wow, a lot more content for the next videos that are coming soon during the holidays. I'm planning on doing skits, stuff like that for you guys. So yeah, man, I appreciate all the support from every single one of you. And if you can, just go ahead, share and like this video. Love you guys, and I'll see you next time. Just being somebody that the neighborhood respected. That my mama could be proud of was the apple of my eye. That's all I ever wanted. Just, just being something, man. So at that point, what else could you ask for?